the cultivation of land and breeding of animals and plants to provide food, fiber, medicinal plants and other products to sustain and enhance life is known as agriculture. India is the second in the world in crop output next to China. 1.4 million square kilometers of land in India is under cultivation. Agriculture is India's biggest economic sector and employ 52.1% of total workforces. Primitive Subsistence Farming It is an old method of farming. It is done on small patches of land. It depends on natural fertility of soil. It depends on rain for irrigation. Its output is low that is low productivity. It is a method to grow for self that is for family. The major example of primitive subsistence farming is slash and burn also known as zooming. Intensive subsistence farming. It is a labor intensive type of farming. It gives out higher output from small land holding. It requires high doses of biochemical inputs and irrigation. The small land holdings are due to right of inheritance that is division of land among successive generations. There is enormous pressure on agricultural land in intensive subsistence farming. Commercial farming. It involves the growth of single crop on large tract of land. It requires higher doses of modern inputs, for example, high yielding variety of seeds, chemical fertilizers, insecticides, pesticides, etc. It is done in order to obtain high output. This type of farming is done for market. Plantation is also a part of commercial farming. It produces raw materials for industries. Rabi crops. These crops are shown in winter and harvested in summer. That is sown in October and December and harvested in April to June. Availability of precipitation during winter months due to the western temperate cyclones helps in the success of these crops. Some of the important rabi crops are wheat, barley, peas, gram and mustard. Kharif crops Kharif crops are grown with the onset of monsoon in different parts of the country and these are harvested in September October that is sown in June July and harvested in September October important crops grown during this season are paddy maize jowar bajra tur that is arhar moong urad cotton jute groundnut and soybean the kharif crops require lots of water to grow which is mostly fulfilled by the monsoon rainfall In between the Rabi and the Kharif seasons, there is a short season during the summer months known as the Zayed season. These crops generally grow in the month of May. The important crops of Zayed season are watermelon, muskmelon, cucumber, vegetables and fodder crops. <laughs>